All right, hey everyone, what's up? How are you all doing? Welcome, hope you're having a good day. Um, today, we're not gonna quite yet play game. We're gonna have a funny experiment. Um, and let me pull up my Discord. All right, I have I have a guest here. And uh, I guess you can introduce hi. yourself. Um, hi, I'm May and I'm here to make Jay's life miserable. No, that's not how you introduce yourself. <laughs> sure, I guess you get... <laughs> But no, we're we're gonna do an exp okay, whatever. <laughs> no, you're gonna help me with experiment. Okay, you wanna say anything else about yourself before we start before I explain the things? Um, so I have never played Celeste before and I am famously unfollowed the Jay's Twitch account. True. So basically what we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you ten clips of Celeste rooms. And I want you to rank them in order from hardest to easiest, from how hard you think they look. Um, some things to point out is that there won't be any audio, because that might give away with the reaction or, or something. The, some clips might have a black box or two on screen, which those basically block out the timer and maybe the heart rate if it's there, so those can't give you any extra information. Wait, this is important knowledge to chat. So we're having a wager. Oh god. <laughs> uh... There is a behind the scenes wager. We we may kind of made a bet, but that's not important right now. Are you ready okay. for the first clip? Uh yeah. All right. It's so silent without audio. But... Yeah, I, I'm looking. So far, it seems tough, but like the regular sort of tough for Celeste, you know? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But I don't want to judge yet until I've seen the other clips. Yeah, that's that okay? fair. Yeah, I mean, you can just put okay, it in okay, somewhere okay. if you want. All right, that's, that's, that's clip number one. Do you want to put that anywhere in the ranking so far? Or do you want to wait till like um, you see more of them? Um, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna put this at number one and then place it down if the next one. Okay, okay, that's fair, that's fair, that's fair, that's fair. Okay, all right then. Um, I guess if you don't have anything else to share, we'll move on to clip number two. There was a like one maneuver in the previous clip. Wait, hold up. Oh, these are a lot of. Sp Bike. But at the same. Hold up. Alright, oh, that's the second clip. Okay, okay, okay. So the thing is, I, on one hand... Oh, by the way, okay, chat real quick. So I don't have, like, a, any experience with Celeste. I do have experience with platformers and speedrunning for those. Okay, on one hand, it seemed like a lot of spikes, which makes it feel very difficult, or at least, like, that the movements have to be pretty precise. Yeah. But on the other hand, there were also a lot of spikes in the... Uh, other level there was just more empty space between them this almost a lot more claustrophobic but right? yeah but yeah. that does i don't know if that necessarily adds to the difficulty because well, most of the maneuvers that decide. they used were the same as in the other clip but then in were the they? other clip they had like more like with the <laughs> like very pixel perfect ledge grabs and stuff mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I mean, if you want to rewatch any clips at some point, you can also do that. If you want, just ask me if you want to rewatch any. For an, I'll, I'll, I'll rewatch later. For now, I'm putting this at second place. All right, all right, all right. Next now one. we'll go to clip number three.
All right, that's clip number three. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Other than the part where it turned into sort of like a dropper, where it mm -hmm. sort of dropped you through it through like a bunch of spikes this one didn't seem that hard because there were just so many platforms along the way all right all right but it feels wrong to have the top three be clip one clip two and clip three <laughs> so now i'm starting to doubt myself the order of the actual clip is randomized right? i just pulled it through a randomizer for the actual clip can i see clip one again? you want to see clip one again that, that's in that. hindsight, I think this one is less difficult than number two. You think so? So I'm changing my ranking. I... All right, you can change Stop it anytime. Stop making me question myself. <laughs> that's the that's the point, though. That's the funny. No, go for it. I'm not. I'm not saying anything. Go for it. You can change it whenever you want. Okay, 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 okay. Two it for as the hardest. Then clip one. Then clip three. All right. So you want to go to clip four now? Yeah. Okay. Oh shit, that went upside down. But does that mean the controls are also reversed? Okay, that was a pretty short one. If you want to see it again, just tell me. Yes, please. Okay. Alright. I don't think this I think this is harder than clip one, but not as hard as clip two. Because this because the turning upside down seems like it's annoying, but once you're able to adapt, it's not that hard to deal with, you know? Mm -hmm. It definitely messes with your brain at first, for sure. <laughs> yeah, no, exactly, but like once you know when to expect... Because I've played Smash Bros, right? And I know where when um, Beer Pillar, oh, yeah, the when Palkia turns the map upside down, yeah, uh, or the, just the controls get reversed. Like, if you're not prepared for it, it's really fucking... Annoying. It messes you up, yeah. I'm putting this one at second place and moving the rest down. All right. Next clip. Oh, also, um, quick side note, chat. So I'm trans. So if my voice like randomly shifts, it's because I'm putting up an act. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is less community. I think there's a lot of uh, trans people in this less community. Uh, someone asked pronouns, which is she, her. She, her. All right. Next clip. I have no fucking clue what's going on. This almost feels like an auto level. Auto? <laughs> Was well, definitely not auto, I can tell. I can spell that word. No, I know, but like. <laughs> Can I see that again? Sure, sure, sure. I feel like the hardest part about this level is not to get a seizure. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So what do you think? This honestly doesn't seem all that hard, just graphically intensive. Can I see clip three again? Is this harder? That that's up to you to decide. <laughs> Which one looks harder to oh, you? Oh, the dropper part. Yeah, okay, this is definitely harder. Okay, so where... I forgot about the part with the dropper. Okay. So my ranking... I put clip 5 at 5th place, the lowest right now. Okay, okay. Uh, so we're gonna go to clip 6, I think we're at. I have a good feeling about this. Okay, this one's pretty short. Don't blink, okay? Otherwise you'll miss it. I'm good at not blinking. That was it. Do you need a rewatch, perhaps? And then you need, and then you die immediately. Yeah, wow. that's, but that was the next. That's a checkpoint. Yeah, that's fine. So since uh, that was like two seconds long, that? yeah, okay, that's what I thought. So it's basically all spikes, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah okay, I'm put. I'm just. I feel pretty confident putting this at least at second place for now. All right. Interesting. So you think even though it's quite sure that it's pretty difficult? Yeah, because it's a lot of precise, like pixel perfect. They're not pixel perfect per se. Maybe it but is just pretty a lot precise. Of precise movement. <laughs> it is pretty precise. Yeah, so we can move on to okay. the next one.
All right, that's clip number. Wait, is it seven? Can I, can I see the? This is seven, yeah. Can I see that one again? Sure. Oh my god, I just discovered something. Well, what did you discover? The spikes, the spikes, are look larger than their hitboxes actually are. I mean, that's often in game design. You often make things look bigger than they actually are, so it's like feels fair to play. That does change the, a lot of. That does change the dropper level, though. Oh, you realize by watching this that the, the spikes aren't as big as you thought? I don't know how Celeste <laughs> spikes work. <laughs> that, that's the funny part. Yeah, clip three, right? Yeah. That's one, I'm putting two, that three. one low. I'm changing clip three and clip five. Okay, but what do you think about the one we just watched? Because we I haven't heard you about clip seven yet. Right, right, right. Sorry. I think... I think most of it is just maneuvering around those spikes, but since they're hitbox, I don't know exactly how large their hitboxes are. But most of those seem generally pretty doable, so I think clip I think clip five. But this is clip seven, right? Yeah, this is clip seven. Actually clip this is goes above clip fi five and clip three, but still under clip number one. Alright, so 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 that's it. You wanna move on to the next one? I think so. Okay, clip eight. Oh, this is just about timing. So what are your thoughts on this top tier game design here? Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> okay. But it's, okay, so my first thought is obviously that this is really, really fucking hard. But I need to think- can I rewatch that? Sure, sure, sure. Okay, so the weird red outlines seem like they're damaging. Might be true. To me. Might be true. I don't know Celeste, so <laughs> that's just my assumption. I don't know if I should tell the you, but kicker, may or may not be. The main kicker in this level to me seems like just the timing to to get the timing right between the jumps of the spike balls. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's all like cycle based, so if you're like get off cycle, then it might be hard to recover. Exactly. You didn't have to like use any double because double jumps are apparently are a mechanic in Celeste. The dashing? I feel like you did or... the dash or double jump, whatever. Mm -hmm. But it you didn't have to use any of those. It's not like you had to stall out the pacing. You just the, the, you were saying the movement is not that complicated. Keep... It's just yeah, like exactly. it just looks precise because a lot of like a lot of like blades and stuff. But it doesn't feel as precise as some of that other shit, like clip 6 or clip 2. Right in between clip 6 and clip 4. So I guess we'll go to the second last clip. After that, I do want to wa rewatch all of the clips just to make sure my judgment is right. Sure, sure, sure. Once you have seen all of them, you may want to go back to rewatch some other ones to have a better comparison. Mm hmm. Okay, so from what I'm noticing, the weird crystals replenish your dashes. Uh, the small green things? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's right. I think this one's the longest one on here. I don't... This... All right. Honestly, what do you think about it? Doesn't seem that difficult. Okay, why do you think it's like Again, easier then? It's just those because it, most of it is just like with the spikes, and you're getting a lot of moments that doesn't have as big a hitbox. Is you get a lot of like those weird feathers that sort of make you move around freely. Yeah. And nothing even really seems to be timing based per se because those blocks don't move until you touch them. Mhm. Mm so what do, what do you think you would about rate this compared to the other clips? At like number seven, or right now like out seven out of nine. 
Number one being the hardest. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, I guess we'll just go to the last clip, and then you can after that you can reward some stuff and get your final ranking swap. Uh, the last one is also pretty fast, so don't blink too much. Okay. Okay, I might want to watch that again. It's it's a bit yeah. of a flashy one. All right. This also feels like an auto level. <laughs> it's definitely not auto, but I kind of see where you're coming from in a way. Right? Because it feels like you're just dashing into something and then it just sort of bounces you around until you reach the end. Yeah, I guess you can't really follow along because you just bounce around a lot, so you're just like, okay, yeah, it kind of looks auto. <laughs> but how difficult do you think it looks? So it, do you think it's like really hard? It's, or? It feels similar with this... With this flipped screen, if you're not expecting it, then this is really fucking hard. Yeah, it's quite a But if you know one. where one thing and where you end up after going into one thing. So where do you think you're gonna put that... this for now? Before rewatching other stuff? Right under clip nine. Or right above clip nine actually. So is there any specific clips you wanna rewatch to change your final ranking? I kinda just wanna rewatch all of them in the order of my rankings. Okay in the order so you want to watch clip if, two first if that's the case so first clip two yeah the thing is this is less precise than clip than clip um clip six i think but this lasts for a lot you have to be consistent for a lot longer yeah, clip six was the two second long one right wasn't it yeah yeah okay. i still think this one is one of the hardest i can see why yeah, okay, that still seems very fucking hard. <laughs> I can I'm, definitely say I'm, this. I mean, I'm all okay of these clips are hard. So far. None of these are really yeah, easy. But... Of course. So that's, that's clip 8, in which you have I might three. actually change this one. Do I change it? I might just put this one at first place, actually. Yeah? Yeah. Alright. Okay, clip 4. Do you want to move that one around at all? I'm good with how it is actually right now. You were bouncing off of the spike just now. In in very specific conditions, some stuff like that might be possible. It's just that you vault <laughs> off. I wall jumped off literal spikes, spikes, you mean? Like just now, just now. Like you're bouncing on top of the spike. That's way harder. <laughs> but do you think you want to move that around for it? I'm moving that one up to number four and moving number clip four up to number five All right it was this one again so you just wait you use double jump to stand on to like bounce off of those spikes or the dash so do you think you want to move this based off your rewatch or do you think you, you have this fine i i don't want to rewatch i don't want to move this one actually okay so we're keeping this one at six so then 10 is next yeah all right do you think you want to move that one up or down at all not gonna, not gonna lie this one feels easier than seven or harder than seven so you want to move I'm that moving up moving this one up one spot and moving seven down one spot also, i'm gonna show one funny thing with you a, a bunch of people in chat before i did this uh, made guesses on mm -hmm. what you would guess. So they're discussing in chat now. <laughs> oh my god, are you placing bad bets on me? A, a, a few people in chat are like, are like ma that? made bets on what you would choose. But don't worry oh, about that. that. <laughs> really? <laughs> I think I'm keeping this one. This one feels harder than clip 9. Still pretty easy though, comparatively speaking. I'll give this you your no time to change up your final no ranking. Eight? No, I'm done. I'm done. This eight, is... two, six, one, four, ten, seven, five, three, nine. So that's your final ranking? Final ranking. All right, then I will give to you the correct answers. This is the empty list, and I'm going to fill them in one by one. Mm -hmm. So at Number 10, we have okay. clip number 4, which you had at 5. The, 
Third one for what's the Yeah. What's the upside down one? Right. That's fair. I Done. guess. At number nine we have Flip three. Which is which you actually have correct. That's the one with the drop right Oh damn, okay. Nice, here we go. Okay. You got one of them. You got one of them. Then I'm the on my way. The next one is clip five, which you also actually have correct. Okay. Going. Then clip number seven. You had seven. The correct answer was clip number ten, which I think you had one above. So that one was one spot off. Yeah. Close. Does that count? No, <laughs> that doesn't Does count. Does it count as me having it correct? Fuck! No, that's not correct. That's a one off. <laughs> okay. Clip number six, or at at number six, is clip number uh, eight, which you had at number one. So that one was. Ah. Which is that's the one with a lot of blades, so. Uh, yeah, that one is a bit deceiving. It looks a lot harder than it actually is just because there's like a lot of shit going on. But like, it's mostly just learning it. And then it's not that bad besides a few parts, at least compared to some of these other ones. Isn't all levels just learning it? Mm, some of them it's pretty obvious what to do, but like the execution is really difficult. Like, but like the really short spike one, it's like obvious you have to go like up and around. But doing it is just really difficult. For this one, it's like, it's not obvious how you're supposed to go through, but like once you know it, it's a lot easier. Uh, number five, we have uh, clip number six. Which is the really short two second one. Which you had a three. It's not too far off. Really? Yeah. I mean, it's really hard. Don't get me wrong. It's it's a really hard thing for two seconds long. But it's not nearly as hard as some of these other ones. Please tell me clip nine is one of the hard... Is clip nine actually in the top four? <laughs> maybe? Maybe? Or... You were bad. No, I... not maybe. It is. <laughs> it is. <laughs> at, at number four is clip two, which you had at number two and had for one at a long time. It's a really claustrophobic one with a lot of spikes. Um, oh, that's fair. This one is intentionally like a tiny bit deceiving because it looks really tight and claustrophobic. And even though it is really, really difficult, it's a lot easier than it actually seems because a lot of the stuff is it's based off four. buffers, which kind of make the timings easier. It's a bit hard to explain, but hmm. it's, a, it's a lot easier than it looks like, but it's still really, really hard. <laughs> Uh, then at number... So I... Hmm? I already lost our bet, didn't I? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> at clip number three, or at spot number two, we have clip number one, which we had at four. That was pretty close. Actually, a fun fact about clip number one. Uh, I made this. This is my map. This is the final screen of my own map. So, um, really? Yeah, I, I made this. Oh, that's really cool. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, which is like barely a bit harder than the clip before it. They're pretty close, but yeah. All right, then. Uh, of course, you'd call your own level hard. <laughs> I like difficult stuff. So here's the one you were waiting for. Clip nine is actually a two and not a ten. <laughs> what the fuck? And then clip number one. Warning. Any... By a no, long shot. Explain to oh. me why clip nine. <laughs> clip nine. Uh, wait. So this is uh, Crystal Garden. Crystal Guard is an infamously very difficult map. It was mainly really hard for a while because people didn't know how to solve it. It was very complicated. It took a while for anyone to beat it. And actually the first one to clear it was me. Uh, I cleared it in secret. I had routed with a bunch of people. And I shadow trapped it. It was really funny. Uh, I was for a long time the only one to ever really? clear this. until there was. A, I think the second clear was like a half a year later or something. But yeah, this went in play for a really long time. And it's indeed a lot harder than it actually looked like. Even for like people that are really good with Celeste and that know a lot about Celeste, they underrank the screen based upon looking at it. It's like it's like difficult to explain why it's that difficult off of if you don't know anything about it. And just this part right here is extremely awkward and precise. Because you can very easily get too much speed and it doesn't work, or you can get too little speed and it doesn't work, and it's really awkward to get like the right window speed. There's just a lot of really awkward moves. This right here, um, you see how he touches this block here? If he collides with this block, he gets stuck. So you can't have him collide with that. But if you hit him too early, you will hit the spike yourself. So you have to like barely hit him before he touches that. 
but then I'll still make it through and it's like extremely tight but like you also couldn't really have known that and like yeah but this screen is just a lot harder than it looks like it's it's the it, I think it's still the second hardest clear screen in like the modded game as a whole or at least close to but at number one we had clip number seven uh which you had at seven but i'll spoil something of this one too this one's top one by like a lot it's not even close <laughs> like for reference really uh so clip number three or the at number three clip number one the third spot took me close to 10 hours to beat then the second one took me 27 hours to beat and then number one was 69 hours uh it's a big <laughs> it's a big jump i'll go there real quick uh, nice. it's this one this one this is the most like infamously known difficult screen in Celeste. And this this was the main screen that wanted me to make this video because this screen looks so easy <laughs> compared to what it actually is. The, the first person that claimed this took 150 hours to beat this or 140. And you might look at it and it's like it doesn't it doesn't look that bad, right? It's just like some gaps, but um I have a full 10 minute video explaining why this screen is so difficult, by the way. It's a lot of like technical stuff, but basically all these gaps are pixel perfect. Like this one's pixel perfect. There's seven pixel perfect gaps. These two are pixel perfect. This one's also pixel perfect. Really? Yep. This part right here is actually the easiest part. And then actually the hardest part is this part right here. This section right here. And the reason that this is so difficult, it's a bit complicated. It involves sub pixels and stuff. Basically, you have a 0.15 pixel window to make this, so it's not pixel perfect, it's 0.15th of a pixel perfect. It's really precise. What? <laughs> so it's not, not pixel perfect, it's 0.15 of a pixel precise, right here. You have to be in the leftmost 0.15 I of this pixel. I don't even know how that works. To be able to get it through this gap. If you're curious, I have this video on my channel called... Um, the hardest Celeste screen to get re-explained, which is in an 11 minute video explaining what makes this screen so difficult and how everything works and all the technical Imagine details. YouTube chapters. So, um, if you're curious and you want to watch that, there you go. I would recommend, I'm pretty proud of this video. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, how many did you get correct? Because there was also a chat prediction for you getting at least three correct. Uh, you got, I, I think it was two of them, right? Three, uh, nine two. and eight. Then but seven. a lot of them were very close. You had a, a few close off. ones, yeah. I need to follow you now. Yeah, that was the bet. If you didn't get half correct, you were gonna follow me. Um, we don't have to speak about what, yes, what would happen had, if like... you got half correct. That's not necessary. No, if if I did get half correct, then I would be able to call you a bottom. Uh... <laughs> but I guess now Thanks. I can. <laughs> 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 oh my god, what did you do? This was your entire goal of being here. This was this this is all you were looking for. It was. Oh, say anything else you want to say or no or ask or I don't know. <laughs> 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 okay, bye. <laughs> Have a good rest of the evening. Thanks for thanks for hanging out.